Let's have a little chat. Agreed. Time for a change of scenery. So, you wanted to tell me something? To tell you the truth. I feel the same. <laughs> Working to change this country. I feel like I've been sailing treacherous waters. To the point that I didn't know if it was fair to make you do this with me. But if I'm being honest, I want you with me on this journey. Every step of the way. In times like these, who knows how long we'll have together. But I want to be there, by your side, for every moment we have. Ah, I was just thinking about you. Hmm, I was thinking of going to the bathhouse, but maybe I'll give it a miss for today. I don't really like that place, to be honest. Truth is, I've got a hairy back. It looks like a horse's mane. That's why my name is written with the character for horse. I've always hated other people seeing my back. Which is why I can't stand it when people stare at me in the bathhouse. But hey, what can I do? Come on, I can't possibly expect you to do that for me. But... I would really appreciate it if you'd accompany me. And who knows? Maybe we could scrub each other's backs, huh? No. Uh, you don't seriously mean that, do you? Ah, no, 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 no. Ah, forget it. I can't show you my back. No, not today. I know. We can face each other, and you can wash my chest. That, I'll be happy to show you. Huh? Ha! <laughs> this is actually starting to sound fun. Let's make plans to go soon. Ah, I was just thinking I'd ask you out for a drink. We should spend some time with just the two of us, now and then. All the more now that we're closer than ever. I know a good place nearby. Follow me. I told you about my big sister, right? Well, I got a letter from her the other day. She just separated from her husband. I always thought they were a perfect match. But I guess love is complicated. <clears throat> I got fairly close to Lady Sana and Oriol, but neither of those relationships really worked out. Hmm? I, I didn't expect you to react like that. I apologize. I did want to make you a little jealous, it's true. Once, I would have described you as a close friend. But now, it feels like we have a deeper connection. You're the only one I feel this way about. It was never like this with anyone else. I know these feelings aren't going to change. Not now. Not after we've reformed our nation. I want to be with you. Always. I have no intention of letting you go tonight. Will you stay with me? Until the morning.
I know you don't like to let anything tie you down. But I just can't help wanting you. All to myself. If we could only hold one another long enough that your scent would also be mine. Well, well. I've never seen you look so sweet before. The more I see of you, the more I like you. Ah, I was just thinking about you. Oh, what's that? <laughs> You're making me blush. What is it? <laughs> I was hoping you'd notice. This cologne is apparently all the rage in Europe. It's a matter of style, see. You're meant to catch a whiff of it now and then. Gives one an air of gentility. Oh, and the cologne I gave you before was specially picked. I thought long and hard about it, so uh, I'm sure it'll suit you. Which reminds me. We should wear each other's scents sometime. That way, we can be together even when we're apart. Don't tell me you're jealous. <laughs> well, it's true that I've had a fair deal of interest come my way. But nobody else comes close to you. How should I put it? It's like there's nothing tying you down. Most people in this country are tied down by something. Status, ideology, duty and what have you. I can't possibly list them all. But you, you're not tied to anything. You're like a bird, soaring on the wind. It's a very attractive quality. <laughs> Makes it hard for me to have eyes for anybody else. You know, I've always admired your strength of spirit. And I'm glad that that hasn't changed now that we're together. But now I've also gotten to see a more vulnerable side of you. And those special moments we share make me crazier about you than ever. I would never have been able to see you that way if we had just stayed close friends. I guess what I'm saying is, I'm happy we're together. I need your help with something. I seem to have angered Ryoma. <sighs> He's living in a dream world if he thinks the Alliance would ever allow Lord Yoshinobu into the new administration. Well, it all comes down to your perspective on the matter. In all truth, neither choice is wrong. Which is why I'm in this bind. Whatever the case, Roma has been indispensable in getting us this far. This isn't the time for infighting. I'll continue to coordinate with Asatsuma. So, I'd like you to keep an eye out on Ryoma. I ran into Oryo near the Omi Inn just now, and told her much the same as you. Please, I need you and Oryo to talk Ryoma around for me. All right. Oh, hello there. Let me guess. You are going to see Ryoma? Oh, I saw Katsura not long ago myself. He asked the same of me. When I left Ryoma at Omi Inn, I told him not to do anything rash, but... He said he was about to hatch a hell of a plan, but who knows what he's up to? Agreed. It's not as if he would listen to us anyway. I just have to keep an eye on him. Ah, oh, I know. What do you say we bring him something? What would he like? 
Care to help me look? Let's get going then. What is it he likes to eat again? Let's get going now that we have our little gift. Yoma should still be at the Omi Inn. Did that come from the Omi Inn? I'll go find help. You get to Ryoma! bad influence on you, but I've taken care of that. <laughs> A word of Tamor and Strife is at hand. Soon you will awaken. Shinzaro is wounded. You have to help him. Worry about yourself now! Pour yourself together! What about your dream? So what big as the ocean? My dream... Yes... I can finally see it. The future of our great nation. Get a hold of with ability, regardless of social status. Create a parliament, and then, then I will travel the world and learn all I can. If you want to change the world, you must start with yourself. I'm counting on you. Hot water, and lots of it. This is going to take a while. Do it. Mm. This might hurt a bit, but you can take it. We've done all we can. Now, we just have to wait. And pray for a miracle. We remain here with him until he awakes. You, go after them. I want him to see it when he opens his eyes. Show him his new Japan. Good to see you. Thanks to you, I'm right as rain again. Just look. Like this, and this. I know you're always looking out for me. I guess that's just how it goes with us, huh? So, while I've been resting, I've had a lot of time to think. Once all this is over, I want to take that trip to America. See, my friends continued fighting for our beliefs, for a new dawn, even when I couldn't. That's how I know Japan will be alright without me. So I want to travel around America and see everything it has to offer. I think everything's pretty much settled down now. Well, <laughs> I, I thought so, but I suppose I was wrong. 
But still, I'm not worried about our future anymore. With you, Katsura, and Katsura around, I know our country is in good hands. Don't say that. You'll make it so much harder for me to leave. But I have to do this. I have to see what a truly new Japan might look like. The truth is, I'd love for you to be there with me. But we each have our own path to walk. And that's why we have to part ways, at least for now. But we'll be reunited one day. You're my counterpart, after all. I just have one last thing to ask you. Will you spar with me? Think about it. We've known each other all this time, but never once properly dueled. Also, I can't be walking around with a sword in America. <laughs> Let me put the samurai part of myself to rest, huh? Let's do it at the place where everything began. The place where we first met. The Magistrate's Estate in Yokohama. So how about it? Care to go around? You sneaky little... <clears throat> Come on, I know you of all people wouldn't do that to me. So how about it? Good answer. Let's go. Visibility is good today. The horizon is crystal clear. We walked all the way here, didn't we, when we first met? Feels like it was only yesterday. Right then. Don't hold back. You got me! Crossing swords with you really brings home how strong you are. Well, now that I fought the strongest warrior around, I can go with no regrets. This is the end of Yoma Sakamoto, the Japanese samurai. From now on, I'm Yoma Sakamoto, citizen of the world! Listen, I want you to have my sword. I'm forever in your debt for all you've done. Besides, it's not like I can carry it around with me in America. There's a saying they have over there. It's always darkest before the dawn. It might feel dark now, but I believe Japan's new dawn is close at hand. If we work together, I know we can iron out these last few problems. And once we do, I can head to America with my conscience clear and mind at ease. That's the spirit! Looks like it's time for you to finally settle the score with your partner. When it came down to it with me and Izo, it was kill or be killed. But I don't want things to go the same way for you. Finish your business and come back alive. Got that, counterpart? I know you can do it. I have absolute faith in you. And when you come back, let's spend some time relaxing, just the two of us. We'll do absolutely nothing together. Until I have to leave. Hmm. Huh? Huh? 